Hey boys and boys, I'm sorry my video is like a week late, but um, I had a really busy week last week and everything, so. Um, last week's topic was the best things about being trans and the hardest things about being trans. And I'm going to start with the hardest because I want to actually end my video on a positive note. <laughs> and for me, I think the hardest thing is knowing that every time I go out in public or talk to someone on the phone or do anything outside of my house that I'm gonna get misgendered. I'm gonna get ma'am and I'm gonna get miss and I'm gonna get the wrong name and it's really I think that's the hardest thing because I feel like I'm trying really hard you know I'm being who I am and um, I have a really hard time hiding my chest uh, I've talked about it before and I have a really hard time with my hips and um, so I think that's the hardest thing, like, and then having people that know that I'm trans misgender me is actually, I think that hurts a little more. Like, if you already know that I'm a dude and you call me she, I don't know, I, I think it's not only disrespectful, it's just like, people don't pay attention. And I think that that, that gets really taxing after a while to put up with it from people that know you know, it's actually easier to take it from my mom because she's my mom and I, you know, I was her daughter for 25 years or whatever and okay, I get that. But like if you only know, knew me like for a little while if, or if you've always known me as trans because I'm pretty open about it, then there's no excuse. And so I think that's like the hardest thing. Um, I had a really hard time with the best thing because like... I'm not ashamed of being trans or anything, but I feel like there's there's not really much that's good about it. Because uh, <laughs> I'm just at this in-between stage, and it, it's not good. It's kind of awful. And so I, I thought about it, and I think that my answer is that the best thing is having support. I mean, like, the people I work with are mostly really cool about it. I'm not going to get fired. I'm not... I'm not really in danger of losing my job. I'm allowed to correct people on my gender. I go by the right name and and that's all fine, you know. And then when I was first going to start hormones, cuz I originally didn't want them. When I was first going to start them a couple months ago, um I was like really scared about it and I was like I don't know cuz it's going to ruin my voice and I'm going to be a caveman and you know all these things that were going through my head and um my boyfriend was just like, well, you need to do what you need to do, and he tried to allay my fears and stuff, and my mom was not helpful. She was just like, well, are you sure you want to do this? Because these reasons and these reasons, and I was like, thanks, mom, you're not helping, and I started talking with some of the girls in my, um, in one of my performance classes, and they were like, I can't wait to hear your voice change. I want to know what it's going to sound like, and I really want to hear you sing these tenor songs, you know, with a deeper register, and on and on, and I had somebody tell me, God, you'd make such a good tenor, and hopefully I'll actually be a tenor, so, you know, cross your fingers for me, but... And the, I think that kind of got rid of the fear some, is that some, some people were, like, excited for me. And they were like, I'm so glad you're doing this, Tim. And, you know, and I finally got hormones. And I, you know, I talked to the people at work about it and on Facebook and stuff. And people were excited then, too. And they were like, oh, my God, that's so cool. I can't wait to, to see what changes. And I can't, you know. And th it's not like they're treating me like a spectacle or like a freak or anything. I think it's more like they're genuinely happy for me that I'm going to that this thing that I've worked so hard for is actually going to come to fruition. And so I think that's the best thing is, is those conversations and the way they make me feel. So that's my last week's video. On Thursday, I'll post my this week's video, hopefully. And I will talk to you guys later. Peace out.